When I was a young guy, out of high school, I had four years of trade drafting. I got my first job in an engineering shop. I moved up quickly. Oh, I was so smart. I moved up to more difficult and difficult projects and received compensation accordingly. But I was a whiz kid. They threw a project at me, I'd nail it. <laughs> and then one day I hit the barrier wall. You think, up, 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 you're going up, up, up. No, I hit the barrier wall. That barrier wall was math. I knew basic math from high school. I even learned trigonometry on the job. But then the next level was calculus. I didn't know calculus. I didn't take it in school. So I bought books on calculus. I never understood it. <laughs> this is the barrier I hit in engineering. I didn't know calculus, which is uh, for uh, uh, calculating curves and things like that, and uh, weights and dealing with uh, safety and structures. I didn't know how to do it. I had no hope of doing it. I tried and tried. I could not understand it. And that's where I was heading for in my next level in engineering was uh, advanced mathematics. As I'm in trouble. <laughs> I hit this wall and I knew I had to get out of engineering because I, the plateau was there. It was staring me in the face. No more whiz kid. Cordy typo now goes stupid because he can't do the math. Well, eventually I got out of engineering, <laughs> thankfully, and got into uh, real estate sales. But you think you're going to go up, 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 up until you meet your nemesis, the thing that's going to bring you down. And that's what happened to me in engineering. I hit this wall called math. I could not leap over it. That's the good thing about investing in the stock market. You don't have to get smarter and smarter and smarter to make more money. You just have to find one good idea and run with it. And you don't need to get any more intelligent. There is no barrier in investing where you have to have this super Einstein intelligence to make money. So that's the only thing I'm happy about is that I never hit that barrier in investing because there is no barrier. 